In this video, you will learn how to merge a series of bracketed photos with different exposures together for a photo with more dynamic range so that you can see the details in the shadows and highlights and the tones throughout the image will be more even. First, launch Aurora HDR 2019. You can open up your files in several different methods. At the startup screen, you can click on Open Image, locate the files that you want to merge into Aurora HDR 2019. For instance, if I click these three, I would click Open. But there's also a couple other ways as well. Another way to do this is to go up to the File menu and choose Open. You can select your files from here. Or you can drag a series of images directly into Aurora. As you can see, the three images that I selected are now visible. This shows the exposure value and also some other features that you'll be able to choose from. Let's take a look at those. By selecting Auto Alignment, this will help align images, particularly if you're not using a tripod and you're hand holding your camera. If you click on the gear icon, you'll see Ghost Reduction. By selecting that option, you'll be able to stop movements, for instance, birds flying through your image, trees blowing in the wind, or other movements, so that there's not that ghost or kind of blurring effect of subjects in your image. You can choose a specific reference image, one of the three that I selected here, and you can also select the amount. We'll go ahead and leave it at medium. The next option is color denoise. Now this option is only visible when you're opening up a raw file, which we did. This is actually to remove the low light color noise when you're merging your bracketed images together. So if you're shooting in low light, this is a good practice to go ahead and click on that little checkbox there. The next one is chromatic aberration reduction. Sometimes when you're looking at an image, you'll see a purple or green fringing around the edges. So this checkbox will actually remove any of that fringing that may occur. We'll go ahead and click on that blue button. Aurora HDR 2019 is now loading the images. It's going to merge them together and we're going to get some great natural results. With the new tone mapping technology for bracketed images with the Quantum HDR engine, we're going to come up with some great natural results.